Hello everyone, a very good afternoon and welcome to Sing and Send. This is the last one for a few weeks and it is one of my absolute favourite little bits of bite-sized Baroque that we learned earlier this year. This is Oh Worship the Lord, which is a little section taken from a wider anthem called Oh Sing Unto the Lord by the great Henry Purcell. And next to Handel, I'm afraid there's not really much uh, much that I won't say about Henry Purcell. He is just the best. Uh, along with Bach and Handel and Vivaldi and Purcell, the, these great geniuses, they set the scene, didn't they, for all of this lovely music that we know and we love. And for me, Purcell is just sheer beauty. A bit like this Delius piece I'm doing with the Marvellous Choir of the Earth. Now, today, obviously, we will be putting down the recording tracks but of course many people watching at the moment are saying i'm not going to record right now uh, i've got builders in or there's things going on and of course that's absolutely fine you can access this session anytime you like the key part though is that you record along with us so that when you send us the file it slots in brilliantly with everyone and of course the most uh, uh, most up-to-date news on Sing and Send is that I'm working hard on Save Us, O Lord, which will be ready for Sunday. It is all ready, to be fair. Sounding fantastic. I've had a few late submissions over the last few hours. If you have the time and you haven't submitted yet, do consider sending us a recording for Save Us, O Lord. I can sneak it in because it's pretty much ready now. Uh, it'll go into the oven, as it were, on Saturday morning and be baked, ready for us all to tuck in on Sunday. Now, just let me run through my sound tricks. How about that? It's been grey and grisly all morning. I press start on home choir and what happens? The sun comes out, ladies and gentlemen. The home choir effects. Honestly, fantastic stuff. Squeaky, squeaky microphone stand. Let's check the other tracks. So we should have all the one voice louder parts. Worship the Lord. Worship the Lord. There he is. <laughs> Soprano Ben. Uh, alto. Worship the Lord. Worship the Lord. Lovely. And tenor. The Lord. And bass, oh, and is, where's my fade out on that? Come on, England. And bass. Oh, worship the Lord. Fantastic. Okay, now do I also have my teaching file? I do. Do we have the full sing through? Oh, worship the Lord. indeed of holiness a quick jump into patchwork theme very echoey today let's take that down a little bit oh worship the lord oh, oh worship the lord in the beauty of holiness marvelous Marvellous Patchway Cathedral. I hope everyone's had a chance to listen to those two Patchway Cathedral tracks, which I put up very recently. The Lux Arumque by Eric Whitaker and the Sanctus from the Pulank Mass in G. If you've not seen them, they're there for you to watch, all free, and uh, would just love a comment and a uh, thumbs up and a share, if you don't mind. Well, look, welcome to everyone. Thank you so much for being here, whether you're watching live or later on. Uh, we have hundreds of people who watch Home Choir after it's been streamed, and I just want to thank all of you for making Home Choir part of your day. Thank you to everyone who leaves us messages underneath the comments if you can't be here live. They are greatly appreciated. Thank you to everyone who gives us the thumbs up. And of course, to those of you who sub sub subscribe, you're my absolute superstars. And do remember, that red button doesn't cost you anything. Absolutely means the world to us. Superb. So uh, welcome to everyone who is here live, but not in the chat. As always, I'm going to say hello to Helen and Bill in California. Hello, folks. Hello to Sue and Tony. Hello to Sally and Annie and Maureen. Hello to Nikki. Hello to Charlotte. Hello to Anne. Hello, Linda. Hello to Val. Hello, Katie in Thornbury. Hello, Huyen. 
and to everyone else who is watching and then who is here goodness me what a fantastic crowd hello Atty. hello allison hello annalisa hello carol hello to christine and terry hello to christine and malcolm i'm sure christine will be along in a minute hello colette hello to dave and jill hello diane hello emma hello gainer hello glennis hello gina watching late, uh, later on hello gloria hello irena hello janet Hello, Jill. Uh, Jean. Hello, Jill. Jill, thank you for your message. I shall get back to you. But lovely to hear from you. Hello to Jill. Hello, Jill. I hope it's all going well in Birmingham there, Jill. Hello, Carith. Hello, Kit Kat. Hello, Linda. Hello, Lisa. Good afternoon, Linda. Hello to Marion. Hello to Mike. Hello, Mike. Lovely to have you gents both with us live here today. Hello, Morik and Fiona. Great to see you both. Morik, I hope you had a good birthday yesterday. Uh, hello to Molly. Uh, Molly, it was... Uh, I know you'll be loved, uh, you'll love to hear this. It was so good to meet James Sills. What a lovely chap he is. My brother from another mother. Great chap he is. Uh, hello to Nicola. Hello, Nikki. Hello, Norb. Hello, Patricia. Hello, Ruth. Hello, Sheila. Hello, Sue. Hello, Susanna. Hello, Suzanne. And uh, hello, Terry, if you're here. Great to see everyone. Hello, Rona. No face to face choir today. Well, it's great to have you with us live. I hope you enjoy. And it is a gorgeous piece of music, this Purcell. And uh, the way we're going to approach it, I learned, I think, from the last session, the results of the recording for Save Us, O Lord, were really, really good. And I think doing those one voice louder parts through really helped the end product. And it just means that certainly compared to the Schubert, which, as you know, sounded brilliant, but took a long time to get together. I mean, that was 10 hours of work to get that Ave Maria. It's a lot of work to do all this mixing. The handle by comparison has taken me about two hours so far and is already pretty much there. A little bit of polish required, a few S's just needing sneaking in and some extra parts that people have sent me in the last couple of days. But uh, I think what we'll do is we'll follow a bit more of the outline of Sing and Send we did last time and that should produce some good results for us. So do enjoy everything. Hello, uh, hello to Jen, lovely to see you. And to everyone, I do hope you enjoy this. Uh, definitely easier for us as well. I'm glad we're all in agreement. And uh, that's the thing. We are all here to enjoy ourselves. I don't want it to be onerous. I want it to be fun, which is why I came up with Sing and Send in the first place. So everyone, I think we should begin. Please make sure you have everything you need for the session. In particular, you will need a drink. The score is going to be here on, on the screen. But if you want to get your own copy, uh, the link is there in the description. But I think we should commence. I'm just going to make sure I've got my right uh, slides here. I have. Uh, good. So let's start. What should we have today? Let's have a G major home choir chord today. Choose any of those notes and sing home choir for me. Let's get started. And... Uh, one of my favorites a lovely big g major chord thank you to all of you and welcome to sing and send this is our recording project uh, that is uh, really at the heart of what we do this is where you sing along with me today you have your phone out uh, you press record you sing and then you just send it to us you don't listen back you don't edit it you don't do anything to it other than you sing and you send the clues in the name and uh, we'll, we'll get started on it in a minute. Just a couple of quick notices, everyone. First of all, you're aware we only have two more live streaming sessions uh, before we have a break of four weeks. But we will be showing you uh, repeats that you have chosen over the last few days. Uh, I've got all those videos ready to go. They'll be uploaded in the next day or so. And then you'll get the links in this week's newsletter. Do remember the newsletter is free to access and all you need to do is go to our website, click newsletter, sign up, fill in your details and you are done. Uh, now, I've been saying I'm going to announce uh, some more of these today. And what I'm, I'm not going to show you the, the title cards. I'm going to issue you with a little bit of a challenge to see if you can guess from the titles of these which ones they are. Okay. And uh, I've told you already that you're going to get the one where Ben opens the box, the one where Ben turns green, you're going to get the one with the handle wig and the one with the mad cats. You know about those. Um, but you're going to get the one with the tricky words. You're going to get the one with the silly hat. And I appreciate that one. You've got a choice. The one with the waistcoat. And the one with the knees up. Okay, I'll say that again. The one with the silly hat, the one with the tricky words, the one with the waistcoat and the one with the knees up. Have a guess 
in the comments. You might be right. You'll, you may have to wait and see. But those are four more of the 16 shows you're going to get throughout August, which will be uploaded as YouTube premieres. So you can come along at your normal time and still see each other and chat with each other. Anna and I won't be here live, but you will have a chance to come together and sing and revisit some of our past history. Now, of course, Friday is Fun Friday. It's our last one of the year. So we're going to have some fun. Uh, as you'd imagine, on Fun Friday, we're going to sing Ode to Cheese, a couple of my Mobile Madness songs, a bit of Gilbert Sullivan. It's going to be great. And then Sunday, well, it's a Handel Fest with Say We're So Lord, Let Justice and Judgment, Lashi Kyupianga, Hallelujah Chorus. If you like Handel, and who doesn't, you're going to love Sunday. All right, everyone. Uh, people are guessing already. Oh, good stuff. Is it a, a happy anniversary, Morgan Fan? That's fantastic. Knees Up Mother Brown, some people are suggesting. Is that Lobachevsky? Which one? Oh, could be. Could be. I'll, I'll tell you what, the Lobachevsky one, I'll, I'll, I'll let you know. I, you might be getting Lobachevsky, but that's not one of the four that I gave you. Okay, uh, so let's get warmed up, shall we? We've got a birthday. In fact, we've got two birthdays to celebrate today. Can I invite you all to stand and let's roll our shoulders around. You're so welcome, everyone. Thank you for your lovely comments. Hello to Stuart. Lovely to see you. Hello, Jackie. Hope you're very well. And Gwen as well. Uh, lovely to see Anna. Hola, Anna. Hola, Jota. Hello to all of you. Okay, and Stuart as well. Great to see you. Okay, let's uh, go full screen. Roll the shoulders around. It's a sing and send day, so we're going to be singing. So we want to make sure that our shoulders are nice and relaxed. Roll them back the other way. Handley fest. <laughs> Indeed. <laughs> our shoulders up. And as you breathe out, let your shoulders relax. <sighs> Fabulous. Hello to Michael. Oh, well, catch up later. Good to see you. Emma is out uh, on Friday uh, for her daughter's prom, which is so exciting. Oh, no, it's tonight, and it's on on Friday. Uh, do give Livia our very best and hope it all goes really well, Emma. That's so exciting. Okay, so a little bit of gentle warm upage, I think. Let's just hum that note together. Deep breath, and... And up a semitone. just yet and again ooh, and an oh, oh, and one more oh, and an ah oh, lovely and now a ma 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 we'll do a minor one as it's Purcell and ma 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 again ma 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 and again Ma, 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 and a now a no, 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 and again, no, 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 and a la, 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 la. That will more than suffice. We're going to sing happy birthday to not one but two lovely home choruses who are celebrating their special day today. And just to say, everyone, today would have been my father's 71st birthday. So I'm just sending my thoughts to him wherever he is. Uh, but we're going to sing happy birthday to uh, Diane, dear Diane, and to Nesta, who are both celebrating their special days today. So happy birthday to Diane and to Nesta. And after two, everyone, one, two. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday. of the day to both of you now everyone let's start the sing and send session i don't press start yet just let me remind you how this works many of you already know what i'm going to say the main part of sing and send is that you are listening along to me on headphones so you've got me playing through on headphones so we're not going to get the recording of me wittering along i'm afraid if you send in a recording with me in the background i can't use it at all so make sure when you record this you're listening to me on one device on headphones and you've got a second device to record on. So let's say you've got your computer, you're listening to me through that and you're recording on your phone. That would be a good, a good example. You're watching me on a tablet, recording on the phone or vice versa, okay? Once we start, don't worry about the recording device, don't go back to it, just ignore it and we'll have fun. I will ask you to record in a moment. 
you sing all the way through don't make cuts if you can and at the very end press stop and send me the whole audio file i really do appreciate it if you're able to do that rather than sending me short bits if you have to send me short bits that's fine but it does take me a lot longer to line them up than it does to just have the whole thing that is very much my preferred option. Uh, now, what we're going to do in a minute, we're going to press record. We're going to sing through each part one voice louder twice. And what I'm going to suggest is those of you who are, for example, sopranos, sing along with that twice. And then we'll do the alto part twice. Then we'll do the tenor part twice and the bass part twice. It's only a minute long, so it's, it's not going to take very long. Then we'll sing it twice through in full. And I'm not going to play one voice louders for the full sing through, but I think with that combination, we'll end up with a really nice selection. And if you want to send in, if you want to sing soprano and alto and tenor, and maybe even a few notes of bass, you're very, very welcome to. If you send it in to whichever part you feel is the most appropriate, I will work it out when I hear it. And I've, I've gotten quite good now at noting that, right, so someone sang alto here, then tenor, then soprano, it's fine. Just label it with one voice or the other and send it in. All right, everyone. So if you're recording, please get ready. And I'm going to ask you to press your recording device now. Marvellous. Well done, everyone. That's fantastic. Now, what we're going to do... Oh. I'm sorry to interrupt. I'm yes. I've sent you the wrong one to send in. Have you? Yes. Oh, dear. Oh, yes, you've, you've sent it to... Oh, that's silly. Ah, Anna sent me the wrong birthdays just as we started. <laughs> okay, she sent us August. That's good. Oh, well, you can't, you can't get the staff. Well, we'll, we'll sing happy birthday to those people whose, uh, whose birthdays are. Let's have a look. Oh, well, I'll, I'll find that and we'll make sure we, we put that right. Apologies to anyone who's had an early birthday. We're not trying to aid you. And uh, we'll sort that out on Friday. Anyway, what I'd like you all to do, everyone, is we are going to have a synchronising clap now. Uh, and so if I count to three, we'll go one, two, three, clap. Are we ready? One, two, three. Thank you very much indeed, everyone. And as I glance at the comments, hello to Julie. Hello to Sarah. Hello, everyone. It's great to see you. Atty says, I'm August. Great stuff. Okay, now. What we need to do is we need to uh, have fun, first of all. And I'm going to bring up the score now for this marvellous piece. And as promised, what we're going to do is we're going to go through each part one voice louder. And uh, we're going to sing it all the way through. I'm going to do each voice, loud part, uh, each voice louder part twice. Okay. Now, if you are a soprano, if I could ask you to get ready to sing. If you'd like to sing soprano with them, you're very welcome to... Okay, so we're going to start off, if you recall, the tenors and basses start. So it's one, oh, worship the Lord, oh, worship the Lord. Are we ready? So we're going to sing along, and this is our first go through. So Sops, this is your one voice louder. Here we go. Worship the Lord. And one. Worship the Lord. And. Worship the Lord. There we go. That's our first sing through. And don't worry if there were any little slips or even if there were a lot of slips. We're going to sing this through again 
and uh, there'll be two full sing throughs later on as well and if i'm honest sops as we go through the one voice ladder parts and the rest if you want to sing your part against the sopranos that works too i just want to have a nice big block of singing that will all fit together beautifully in the end so let's have that again this will be the sop uh, one voice louder part and so there's your starting note of course it's tenors and basses who start off okay are we ready so again from the beginning Three, four, one. one of my favorite bits of Purcell and that is saying something so now let's sing it through with the alto voice louder we're going to do this twice so if you'd like to sing alto with this one you're very welcome to and uh, remembering of course some of you will be recording this later on so use this as practice and then sing through the whole session singing as many of the parts as you like and I'm really looking forward to combining all this in the studio and having you as the guest choir of course in Patchway Cathedral cheers Patchwork Cathedral Choir, a very friendly bunch. Now, uh, we start again in the second bar. So the tenors and basses give us that little run in, and then the altos come in. Are we ready? Here we go. This is the alto sing through for the first time. And deep breath, and one. Fabulous. That last anticipation is really quite hard to time, so just do your best and uh, we'll get that all sorted in the studio later. Let's do it again. Okay, I love this alto line. Just to say, I'm sure you already noticed that gorgeous. Really grow through that so that when it clashes with the sopranos, it's absolutely amazing. Okay, alto second sing through. There's your note. As sopranos, if anyone else wants to sing their lines along, please do. We will use every part of the buffalo, as it were, when we come to combine this in the studio. But this is the alto one voice ladder for the second time. Ready, everyone? Here we go. And. And one.
fabulous thank you so much altos now we're going to go back to the beginning we're going to sing the tenor part with that voice louder if you are a sop and an alto and you want to keep singing your part against the tenors please feel free to do so the more of you that sing throughout this the more of a wonderful block of marble as i say i have to be able to combine and we end up with hundreds and hundreds of voices singing together the handle will show you what i mean it's absolutely brilliant but let's uh, let's sing this through so there's a chord and we're straight in don't sing this time but it is this quick it's okay so it's pretty much straight in it's one oh, worship the lord oh okay and a quite a dark sound from you please tenors all right so there's your notes and everyone else please feel free to sing but this is the tenor voice louder part for the first time here we go and uh, Worship the Lord. Worship the Lord in the beauty of holiness. Worship the Lord. Oh, oh, worship the Lord in the beauty. This is the thing. If you if you don't know the music of Henry Purcell desperately well, listen to the whole anthem, Oh Sing Unto the Lord. It's one of my favourites. It was one of my first um, first solo roles as a baritone when I was 17, 18. I was asked to sing it, and I just completely and utterly fell in love with this music. It was around the time of the... Um, would have been the... Just trying to think. 300th anniversary of his death was uh, was in the early 90s and i remember the huge amounts of celebration and pomp and circumstance around his music and uh, i just absolutely fell in love with it tenors one more time voice louder then we'll do the basses then we'll sing in full and then that is it for today everyone so tenors there we are from the start here's your chord and we're going to get started and uh worship the lord the tenors and we have now the basses to firm up our foundations before we have two full sing throughs with everyone and we hear how all of this gorgeous harmony comes together so basses as we end up getting lower and lower throughout this one i want some really nice rich deep deep chest resonance from me but when we're up high don't belt it too much float the high notes here oh worship the lord okay light at the top good and strong at the 
bottom plea spaces. Okay, here we go. So you'll hear the call. Let me just demonstrate. So don't sing yet. We get... Oh, worship the Lord. So it's pretty much straight in. There's our note. Ready? Three, four. Oh, worship the Lord. Oh, worship the Lord. Oh, worship the Lord in the beauty. I should have said at the start, if that F is too low, just go up or stay on the C. Either is absolutely fine with me. Okay, thank you, everyone. One more time. How's everyone doing in the comments? Oh, well done. Alison, you get a star for sight reading that. Five, oh, thank you. Seeing sight also been a dream come true. I'm not sure everyone would agree <laughs> statement particularly my poor family had to listen to me sing alto but thank you Alison. that's lovely and definitely gold stars all around everyone bases one voice louder one more time are we ready so there's your notes deep breath and uh... oh, worship the Lord. Oh, and one oh, worship the Lord in the beauty of everyone so we've been through the piece eight times now one voice louder each time now we're going to have it twice through with the full version with the acoustic of patchwork cathedrals give you the full effect of it all sing whichever part you like or if you think you've sung enough or if you want to wait till later on just listen and enjoy this gorgeous gorgeous harmony nobody writes quite like purcell and uh, we will be doing much more of his work in the coming year from september onwards but for now this is the first full sing through. We'll do two of these and then we'll be pressing stop on our recording devices. But not yet. Here we go. So you'll hear uh, the chord and we'll be off. Oh,
lovely. So lovely. Now we're going to have that once more. And it really is, I'm afraid it's as quick as boom, and we're straight in. So tenors of aces, I'll, I'll give you a little bit longer to prepare for this last sing through. And just thank you ever, ever so much, everyone. I really hope you're enjoying this lovely piece. Just to say, it does finish on that bare fifth. And what follows straight away. Tell it out among the heathen that the Lord is king. It does brighten up after that point. But uh, let's let's stick with the with the darker sound of herself for now. And this will be the last sing through. So tell us the basses there. Deep breath. Here we go. And. Uh, oh, sorry. What happened there? <laughs> Lots of tennis bass around the way. Uh, uh, uh. Bear with me a second. Oh, the video hasn't rewound. Gosh, it's like going back to the early days of the 1980s. Okay. Yes, all right. Except it's not showing the score. Bear with me a second, everyone. Let's push the right button. Here we go. Okay. Got it sorted. Nice deep breath and. it everyone so in the end we went through it 10 times and hopefully those of you watching were able to record and if you're not recording till later on just do me a favor if you can record uh, just press record when i say sing all the way through don't worry about errors and gremlins and glitches and you know things in the wrong place there's plenty of that happening at this end but just sing and just send and the end result well you heard the schubert you'll be hearing the fabulous handle this weekend and I hope that will inspire you to send me as much Purcell as you can. And remember, there'll be much more coming up in the autumn. Now, everyone, please press stop on your recording device now. Thank you very much indeed. I really do appreciate that. And uh, just glancing at the comments. Hello to everyone who's joined us. Hello to Sue. Hello to Michael. Hello to Catherine. It's lovely to see so many of you joining us during the broadcast. And I hope you enjoy it. Now... What you do with that? Well, you send us a, your recording to this address, Home Choir Recordings. Note the two R's in the middle and the S on the end at yahoo.com. The Yahoo bit is important because we're still trying to get homechoir.uk to, to accept our emails. So Home Choir Recordings at yahoo.com by August the 20th. That gives you several weeks. That's over three weeks to get that to us. Of course, you get it done earlier. Brilliant. But I certainly won't be looking at anything in that folder until uh, a couple of days after August the 20th. So you've got plenty of time. Send us multiple parts if you like. The bigger choir, the better, as far as I'm concerned on this one. Okay, now please remember, please label it properly. Purcell, space O, letter O, space worship, space the, space Lord, space, and then your voice part. There's no alto one, two, or anything like that. It's a soprano, alto, tenor, bass. Put that as the email subject, and then this fabulous bit of code which Andreas has built for us we'll pick it up and then uh, we can make sure it all drops into the right file as you would hope all right everyone so that's August the 20th please label it properly all the information is of course on the website if you have any questions but thank you I really appreciate it now sing and send will be back in the autumn we won't launch straight into it in the first couple of weeks but uh, we'll start up again i should think towards the end of september we're going to record un poquito cantas we're going to record a special version of my lag and love 
um, because of course my dear friend Eric Weatherall, who gave us his pieces to perform uh, at the start of lockdown, he passed away in uh, January of last year at the age of 95, having written music for most of his life. And I'm going to be conducting a very special concert in November of this year in memory of Eric. And uh, Eric's wife, Liz, has asked if Home Choir would record My Lag and Love to be played at this special concert in St Mary Redcliffe Church here in Bristol. It's a magnificent venue and uh, your voices will sound amazing echoing around that ancient church which Queen Elizabeth I herself said was the fairest church in all the land so your voices will be played in this gorgeous acoustic we're also going to record Jesus Joy of Man's Desiring uh, and that will be obviously for all of us but in particular we're going to dedicate that to James and Judy two of our home choristers who will be getting married later this year and they will play that at their wedding so Sing and Send is really going up to the next level next year. Now, everyone, uh, we've done a really fantastic job over the last few weeks with Sing and Send. I'm just so grateful to all of you for taking part. Thank you so much for being part of Home Choir. Now, coffee time. And normally I say, you know, it's just an opportunity for you to offload and some people sort of scoff and so on. But given what's been going on in the world of digital choirs in the last couple of days, I should imagine that some of you have got some things to say. So this is my turn to just shut up. And I'm just going to look into the camera and you just tell me what's on your mind and you can tell me anything you like. I promise I won't break your trust. What's going on in your lives, folks? Yeah. That's a lot to deal with. How do you feel about that, folks? Hmm. Well, what I'd say to you is, and I've said this before, but anyone in your situation would feel the same way. And if you feel like it's going to get the better of you, just keep going. I think these things have a way of working themselves out one way or the other. I'm proud of you. Keep going. Well done. Thanks ever, ever so much, everyone. As always, a huge pleasure to be here in front of you. I hope you've enjoyed Sing and Send. And uh, those of you in Choir of the Earth um, who were talking to me particularly loudly, I could just sense there, was, there were a lot of Choir of the Earth choristers talking to me just then, as I say. These things have a, a tendency to pass. I feel all will be well. And I think that about all of us here at Home Choir, uh, this is a fantastic community that is going absolutely nowhere other than forwards together. So I look forward to seeing you on Fun Friday for a real giggle. Uh, keep an eye out for those, uh, those 16 files which are going to be uploaded in the next few days. You should start seeing them in your uh, upcoming youtube uh youtube greats and of course we will put that all together in the newsletter so you'll have all 16 with the dates and times and just click straight to it a few people have said i'm not sure how i'd find the next broadcast well it will all be on the website remember if you go to our website it will always show you the next broadcast that is due uh so if you're in, if, ever in any doubt i think i don't know when the next broadcast is go to the website click on that big image on the front page and it'll take you straight to the broadcast in the meantime everyone have a good day enjoy the rest of your day and i will see you on friday all right lots of love all the best <laughs>